crowd cheered skipper Rob Hindmarsh and the team onto the pitch and gave a rapturous welcome to England goalkeeper Peter Shooten. Derby's task was made easier with the dramatic sending off of Luton striker Mick Harford after four minutes, following a clumsy challenge on Mel Sage and a little belligerent back chat to referee George Courtney, Harford returned down the tunnel. G beat Foster on the left, centred, and with Gregory and Davison closing in, Derby nearly took an early lead. But Derby took the lead in the 18th minute from Callahan's corner from the left. Seeley parried Gregory's header, but couldn't stop the follow-up. 35 minutes had gone before Shilton was called into service clasping Creasy's centre from the left. In the second half, Gregory set up George Williams for a dig from the edge of the box, but Seeley plunged to his right to save. And then Gregory deftly nudged one through to Davison, who was floored by Foster. The Luton skipper was lucky not to be sent off after an earlier booking. Williams nearly gave the crowd a goal to remember after a rampaging charge through the Luton ranks and a lob that cleared goalkeeper Seeley, but unfortunately the crossbar as well. Mickle White also nearly produced a fine solo goal after a weaving run, his fierce shot just sailed off target. The ten men of Luton posed little.